are talking about rearranging and sprucing up things in your home. It can be so much fun, but sometimes it can be tricky just to know where to start. So organizational guru and home decor expert Helen Austin is in studio with us to share some insights how to freshen up, specifically coffee tables, yep. Helen. Yep. Um, thank you so much for joining us yep. today. Love being here. We love it too, <laughs> and we're just going to, where do we even start, Helen? How, okay. do we, how do we get rolling? When we decorate anything or design too, we start with function. So always ask yourself whatever surface you're decorating what function does it serve so a coffee table like your drink needs to be able to fit on there right like yes. preferably right hence the coffee so whatever beverage it is and then if you're watching TV you need to be able to see the TV or if you're chatting with a friend you need to be able to like fully see them right okay. so we want to make sure we don't do anything so large mm -hmm. you know that it obstructs a view or so that you can't fit a cup of coffee or whatever your drink on the table right. so start there so scale matters this is all about sizing okay all right okay, so, so I'm hearing understand the function Yes. And then understand the size um, of what you're placing on there. Okay. So perfect. we want varied size. Okay. We want like some small, medium, and large. And yeah. then you kind of play with it. So really great options to work with. I love putting a plant or something living or something that appears living. So if you don't have a green thumb, that's okay. <laughs> yes. So I know a lot of people are really against faux plants. It's also, this is about preference. This is about you. Right. Okay. So I love, love plants. These. these are so cute. Oh <laughs> and my I love gosh. a little, like a little quirkiness. So a I kind fun. of love these pots. Books are great because they can be so personal. I know we like make jokes about coffee table books, uh -huh. but there are those things where they can be a self-expression. So if you have a hobby, you love a certain artist. Okay. You love certain photography this can be something that's kind of like this little extra element of you sure. that reminds you of things that you really enjoy and okay. they're just good for stacking and ranging in different ways you can see I have them in like two different spots on yeah. this and this one I feel like is using a function to elevate this it's really is. it's to elevate <laughs> it right so because I want kind of this like staggered effect so yeah. that the eye travels if you had everything too big it would look cluttered everything too small it would look cluttered yes so you, you kind of mess with it also I love storage I love yeah. finding little boxes to oh, put on there okay, so so your remote is in here, yes. you know, I like, or at least the remote goes on the tray so yeah. that you have that one spot coasters, right? I love so that, that they're not visually, you know, taking up space. And also my dog loves to eat remotes, so I use these <laughs> a lot. So we have to use them. Well, and I know that you've talked about everything having a home or yeah, a purpose. Right? So it does. And that's, that's what fantastic. that offers. Trays are really great for defining that space yes. if you don't have a tray. That's where books can kind of be arranged flat and then you can build on those as well. Okay. Thrift stores, like your retail, yeah. major retailers you can get this stuff anywhere so this could be really really inexpensive but okay. start by shopping your own house oh, okay. we tend to have so many things in our own house we're not using just play with them and experiment have fun this shouldn't be overwhelming this should just be kind of like range it when we do a styling on mm -hmm. a house mm -hmm. we are literally experimenting I will set things we step back we look set things a different way, go back and look. This yeah. is not like, I've got this, it goes here, 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 and I'm done. Yeah. It is not, it doesn't, I'm a professional and it doesn't work that way for me. And I love, <laughs> again, that you talk about functionality and then just sit back and, does it work for you? Right. And if it doesn't, kind of Then switch. just adjust it and have fun so with good. it. Like, this is not supposed to be yeah. something that's stressful for okay, you. Okay, well, this is why she <laughs> is our guru, our go-to lady. Thank you so much for coming in. Um, she wants to share more with you, so if you are looking for strategies, if you're looking for di design inspiration, visit Helen Austin Com. Again, thank you so much. This is incredible. I feel like I just want to take it and go put it in my living room.